Hello my brothers and sisters, and welcome back to another Rapture Packed episode. And I punched myself in tip the pumpkin shoulder episode of Chris the Butcher. Friends. Right, I've done something like this similar on the channel of oh God Almighty about it about six years ago. Put it this way, I was in the old house, not this house I'm in now, and I've been in this house for nearly four years. Alright? So it was in the old house down there over there, you know, end of my finger there. Anyway, it's basically hot dogs with puff pastry with cheese. It's basically a, a cheesy hot dog roll, I suppose. So the ingredients are puff pastry. Before anyone says, oh, he couldn't even make his own puff pastry, the lazy bastard. Why would I fuck around making puff pastry? That takes apparently hours when I could just go to the shop and buy that for a quid, right? <laughs> Tin of hot dogs, I think they were 59 pence. 15 slices of cheese, they were 70, I think they were 75 pence for 15 slices. Obviously, I want some egg for the top of it, so I've got six egg. Well, there's three left there. I've had them about a week. And uh, a tin opener for hot dogs. So, uh, I have no idea how I'm doing this yet. Uh, I, think the, I think the first thing to do is open this puff pastry and uh, assess the situation from there. So, uh, let's do that. It says on the instructions to leave it out of the fridge for 15 minutes before you use it. It's been out for about an hour. Uh basically unroll it so it stays on the uh, the uh, baking paper basically but like I said I'm not sure I will leave it on the baking paper it's still a bit cold that but I need to assess how I'm going to cut that's similar that size to that wouldn't it but I only want one sausage in each one so should I cut it that way should I cut it a bit thinner I don't know, you know. Right, bear with me, we'll uh we'll work it out. <laughs> right, okay. Uh you know when I measured the tin on the uh on the pastry? Well, I didn't realise <laughs> the state of that What the hell? <laughs> I thought they were gonna be bigger than that, but hey, you live and learn, don't you? I ain't got X-ray glasses, I cannot see through a tin, right? Uh, so on that assumption, I'll go and get me a, uh, get me a, uh, what's it called? Go on mate, get me Samurai. I'm sure I've had it, oh, I've already cleaned it. Alright, get me Samurai and I think, I'm going to have to lean over this way. I think we're just going to cut that into three. I think one, one, two, three. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, because it'll be enough to roll it, won't it? It'll be enough to roll it in. So I'm just going to go one, two, three. Because uh, I want to put, how many do I get there? One, two, about another three there, you right? What do you reckon? Another three? Is that right? Three? Three? A bit shorter with that one? Three? Oh no. Listen, <laughs> if I fuck this up, I ain't got any more pastry. I'm certainly not making any, so uh, we'll have to uh, we'll have to uh, think about this. Right, I'll be back with you in about two minutes when I do my physics. I have decided to wrap the cheese around the sausage roll, or around the sausage, around the sausage roll, around the hot dog sausage. So basically, that should give me enough pastry that to uh, just lift it, you know, roll it round, roll it round. Come on, separate your twat. There, and crush it, uh, I think we do there, like that. I might cut a bit off the ends, but something like that. Let's get my knife, where's my knife again? My God, looks like a freaking really shit Christmas cracker, doesn't it? 
You know the shit, they will get the paper hat in it and a, a crap joke and uh, something that's absolutely useless to anybody's life in the world ever. Right. Take it off there, we don't want excess pastry on, do we? So basically, I think we just score it a little bit. Something like that. You can't see it, can you? Throw some egg wash on it. And, er... Uh, okay, I'll air presto. Get it in the oven. Right, that is one. There's got there's nine pieces there, so I've, I've only got eight sausage rolls. So I'll crack on, and the next time you see this, they'll be in a roasting tin, ready for some egg wash. I ain't got a pasting brush, can't find it. So I'm going to be attempting egg wash, basting with the back of a spoon. I finished them. Honest to God, with my, even my big massive sausage fingers, they only took about five minutes to do. Well, a bit tricky if you've got more dainty hands or dainty fingers, you haven't got massive shovels like mine, it'll probably be a little bit quicker. But uh, yeah, I've already beaten some egg as well, and there's my trusty spoon. I wish I had my pasting brush, it'd make this a damn sight easier, wouldn't it? So, I don't know, I'm going to do this. I can't even get the egg on there, do I? There you go. Oh, oh look at that. <laughs> Maybe a bit too much on that, to be fair. Just, just paste, oh. Yeah, I need a pasting brush, don't I? I'm going to have to buy myself a new pasting brush. And I guarantee, as soon as I buy one, Oh, by the way, I put a bit of oil on the bottom of that pan. As soon as I buy one, guaranteed I'll find it. So in the meantime, Lou's going to be... If Lou watches this now, she's going to be spewing. She's going to get the fingers in. Look at that. Yeah. Just massage it. I'm, I'm not bothered about... I'm not squeamish, right? I'm not squeamish when it comes to egg and stuff. Just get your fingers in. But you want to make sure them are... Uh, spaced out. Because you don't want them sticking together, moulding together, becoming one, do you? We're to become one. <laughs> only, only me can get Spice Girls into, <laughs> into a video. Huh? Oh, look at that, like, snot that. That looked like something else as well, that. I'm not going to say it. I'm certainly not going to say it. Because that's bit, that's it, that is wrong and disgusting. Right. Just, just massage it in. Ooh. Right, well it's got a beaten egg on it. Some some shape or form on it. There's oil on the bottom of the pan. Like I said, I want to keep these Oh the slide, you know, like fucking like cool runnings these bastards. Right, that'll do. I've wasted that obviously. Unless uh I don't know, one of the kids wants an omelette or something later, but I've got the big fat Germans in a manner. So uh, yeah, right there we are. Eight Hot dog, cheesy hot dog rolls. I don't know what I'm calling them yet, but it'd be something around them lines. A cheesy hot dog roll, hot dog cheesy roll. I ain't got a clue, but uh, then we're going in and I'll stuck you. You'll see me in 20 minutes. Well, brothers and sisters, uh, we've had a bit of a disaster. It's not like me having a disaster, isn't it, when it comes to the uh, culinary expertise in the kitchen, is it? Now, I did oil the roasting tin. But as you can quite clearly see there, they've stuck. <clears throat> but you know what? They smell good, and I'm sure they're going to make a hot doggy, cheesy, puff pastry kind of turd. Right, I'm going to try and get these out of here. Keep them in one piece and uh, slide one down my gizzard. Do you know what? Out of the eight I've cooked, there's six there. Yeah, there's only two that didn't stick to the bottom. So I think it would be rude if I didn't cut one in half. I'll, I'll show you this. Look, look at that. It's it's like a it's like a proper sausage roll, isn't it? You know what I mean? Two out of eight's not bad, is it? Ah. Uh. A cheesy hot dog roll. Cheesy sausage. No, it's not a sausage. It's a cheesy hot dog roll, basically. That's what I'm going to call it. Perfect fit kids. Party treats. If you don't, <laughs> if you can stop them sticking. Right, there's that one. That, the other one's going to be exactly the same. So I'm going to sort of thumbnail it like, and we're going to get up here and slide one of them. Damn it, gizzard.
There it is, brothers and sisters. In all its blurry glory. Okay, then. Can you see me now? Dry is going, by the way. Sunday. Now I can do. Washing was on earlier on as well. Spin in there, fuck out of the kitchen. But I waited for that to finish, so carry on. Anyway, cheesy hot dog rolls. Perfect for a party. Or perfect just for kids. Especially when you got a little lad with a, a special needs autism and he'll only eat certain things. Especially, he'll only eat it if it's got cheese with it and hot dogs. So these are perfect for him. So anyone else out there with special needs kids, and they, they, they struggle. Because, you know, I, I hear it all the time. Oh, my lad's the same. He'll only eat beige foods. He'll, they'll only eat a, a certain food cut a certain way. I know all about it. I've had it with Connor. I've now got it with Kieran. And this Kieran, it's, it has to be cheese. Anything with cheese, it's cheese. Have it, have it. Well, Kieran's a school. Uh, before you go into his class, uh, outside the main entrance there, there's a, there's a board. And it tells there's three options for what he can have for dinner. And I have to stop and tell him what the options are. And as soon as I said cheese, cheese! <laughs> out, he knows what he's having for tea. Dinner, lunch, brunch, God knows what they call it anyway. We call anything round about lunchtime dinner, right? Tea, tea is like six o'clock at night. Tea is not afternoon tea with fucking cake and biscuits and a cup of fucking coffee. <sighs> no, it's not. Well, not in an, uh, not in Oldham, it isn't, anyway. Right, so there we have our cheesy hot dog rolls. Sorry, I, I, I lost my train of thought there, didn't I? I was just going off, a, off on a tandem somewhere else. Not a tandem, not, not the bike. Let's get down my gizzard. You know what that needs? It just needs some sort of dip. Maybe a tomato ketchup or a barbecue sauce. Or it's been in the chamber. I wish you. Some hot reaper sauce or something like that. Or something from uh, Sellerfield, uh, you know, that nu nuclear, it blows your fucking head off. A little bit stodgy, but you know what I mean? It's expected, this cheese, this hot dog, and this puff pastry. So that's why you need a bit of uh, a bit of lubricant for sausage, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> mm. Other than that, fucking banging. That's them, brothers and sisters. A bit of a close up for you. The six underneath have lost the, lost the bottoms. It doesn't matter, they're going to go down the same hole and come out the same hole, aren't they? Oh, I am. Hopefully. How would I improve them? How would I improve them? What I did, probably not a lot. The cooking, definitely. Maybe, instead of oil in the pan, maybe get a non-stick pan that works. <laughs> that actually is non-stick maybe cook them on some baking paper and leave that in there so it don't stick to the bottom of the pan maybe cook them on a rack i said on a rack not in a rack <laughs> before anyone says anything that's basically the only way i can say i could improve it and that's basically the cooking you could put a splodge of tomato ketchup in there before you roll it up but it will get messy when you can all at the end of the day you can all you can do is put a little bit of tomato ketchup or a bit of barbecue sauce or a bit of hot sauce or a bit of mayonnaise, a bit of salad cream, whatever the fuck you want. Just dip it, dip it in. Smash the fuck out of the dip. So it's coming all over your arm like you're just looking like a fucking Neanderthal just fucking, just been outside, cut the fuck out of a brontosaurus, dragged it in. Whoa, whoa, what have you got? Now get stuck in. Ah. Don't know where that come from, gotta be honest. Must be just me wanting to wave my fucking arms around like a fucking budgie on fucking ecstasy or speed or something. Anyway, I liked them. If you like this, press like, comment, share it on your social media, and subscribe. I'll become a family member of hashtag TFCT. B! Where I 
腹筋ロビア